John here with Dallas Drainage Pros and just want to walk you through the science of a good system. All right, so this is the beginning of the line. And of course, right there, the downspout's connected to a long turn 90. So often we see short turn 90s, which make for, uh, first of all, hard pass for the water. The water doesn't flow as well. But it also makes it impossible to clean. Um, for example, if that was a short turn 90 and that created a wall, a hose would not pass through there. A jetter would not be able to uh, go past that point. So that long turn 90 allows for easy pass of a drain cleaning machine and easy flow of water. Now here, again the same thing, a long turn 90. And what we have here is a sanitary T. You can see that T is directional, which forces the water to go the direction that we want it to, which is that way. If that was a regular T, the water would hit that pipe and go both directions, um, which would interfere with flow. And during a big storm, that matters. Um, you wanna have a sanitary T that is directional and point it the direction you want the water to be flowing. Here we've just got some modified irrigation. It was in the way. That's done perfectly. Again, same thing. You can see that T is directional and the water's flowing that way. So when this water, which is coming from another downspout, joins that line, it flows in the correct direction. Again, a long turn 90. And just a little something we added because this line was so long and it included a 90 degree turn, just because there was potential for blockage, we added a clean out. So this right here, after the system is installed, and remember this pipe is pretty much immobile once the dirt is put back. But because we added a clean out, now this line is very serviceable and can be cleaned at a later date if need be. And of course that's installed um, below the grass line. So the mower will pass right over it. So there's your sanitary tea that flows in the direction of the water. Currently just tying in the remaining portion of this system. Doing a great job. Looking perfect. This section right here is the overflow from the pool. So this is a great way to drain water overflowing from the pool. This is chlorinated water, so you don't want it going into your landscape. Um, but it's to, to drain it into a drainage system. And then finally, we'll have a discharge on the other side of that fence. Just giving you a shot of what this is going to look like. That pipe is gonna go through a core drilled hole um, at the base of that concrete wall. A lot of people just put a pop-up right there on the edge, something that will allow the water to emit this way. Um, we just don't like to do that whenever possible. Um, a direct outlet discharge makes for easy flow and the system self cleans because the water flows a lot faster and it makes it easier to clean. So um, there's just a lot of reasons why an open discharge is better if you have that as an option. Just like that. And so now the water will pass right through and the system is gonna work great. Perfect. And that is why you like a direct clean out. Easy flow, 
self-cleaning, perfect. Well, there you have it. The science of a well-installed system. Dallas Drainage Pros.